Good evening fellow YouTubers and here I am in the uh, kiddies bedroom I've come up to make this vlog quickly uh, before the kids invade the room and I get kicked out right um, a bit of an update of what I've been up to over this last six days I've been on this um, juicy malarkey thingy um, uh, where is it uh, fat ill or fat sick and nearly dead that malarkey and I've been on it for six days now and um, first day were pretty crap to be honest as, as I said in my last vlog um, I, I felt really bad actually um, but after about to three days they weren't too bad so now I'm on six I feel really as fit as a as fit as a, a butcher's dog so uh, I'm quite happy about it so um, why am I doing this the reason I'm doing this is give uh, to give my wife Sue a bit of support because uh, she's going to try and lose a, a few pound and all so I thought to do a sort of a regular weekly uh, update on how things are progressing. Um, so yeah, you say weekly. I mean, how long we're we going to be on this? I don't know, to be absolutely honest. Um, we want to try and stop on as long as we feel comfortable. Let's put it that way. It is very, very difficult to do, um, but the weight does drop off you and I'm sure it'll pile back on as well as soon as you stop uh, however what we want to do is try and lose as much as we can in as least time as possible therefore being able to get on a proper uh, maintained balanced diet if you know what I mean so um, my plans are I mean I started at 17 stone four pounds at the beginning of the week I think it was Monday when we started I'm not going to tell you what Sue weighed because that would be naughty uh, but I have lost um, how much have I lost ten pound eight ounces and Sue's lost nine pounds which for six days is a lot and I didn't realise we'd get this sort of effect now what we have been doing is uh, trying to get a, a, a balance of about 80% of vegetables through the blender and 20% fruit and to be honest the bloody vegetable malarkey tastes absolute shite it's, it's bloody disgusting so we're going to have to look at a few menus to, to make it edible really or drinkable so um, we're going on to face week two and uh, you know we're going to try and see if we can go for two weeks and see how we go from there but so far um, I feel quite a lot better it is hard work but I feel fit I feel healthy um, Sue has been suffering with the legs very badly uh, for a long time now and we've had issues with uh, our legs so much so that uh, uh, you know we've got to take some drastic measures regarding the diet in malarkey and she's had got arthritis in her legs and it seems to have helped that issue in so much as her legs are not hurting her so much and also um, her legs were swelling and uh, the the doctor says that you know you could have water tablets but she didn't want to start having tablets because she's never had tablets and neither have I all, all my life so we thought we'd try this and to be honest it's eased as well uh, her legs are not hurting so badly she used to get terrible pains in her leg at night when we went to bed uh, and she couldn't get sleep unless she had some paracetamol and, uh, and she didn't take those very often she suffered more than not but that pain is, is gone and um, we're starting to do a lot more exercise uh, Sue's starting to walk around the block a couple of times she's not very you know she don't like exercise that's the trouble with my wife but uh, yeah she's doing well so 
basically for week one it's worth going on to week two if you know what I mean so when we go shopping um, we're going to get a different mix of vegetables see if we can get something that we like rather than the crap that we've had this week basically because I, I just didn't know what to buy so I'm going to try different things now one or two people have said that um, you know the the they wouldn't do it because of different reasons but one of them was that the vegetables would be too dear to buy to do it um, so I'll tell you what I've bought up to now because I've kept a record of it I've, I bought 60 quid's worth of fruit and veg at the beginning of the week from the wholesale place that we got okay it might have been the wrong stuff but it was 60 quid's worth so and we've got enough to last us through the week so we're going off for tomorrow easily and perhaps a little bit left over uh, for next week but 30 quid each for a week I don't think that's too dear really it's only like going out for a meal out in the UK I don't know what it is in America you can get you know you can eat for bloody five dollars or whatever but over here you know it costs you about 60 quid for a night out but any road up I just thought I'd give you an update uh, I know I'm not on my bike but uh, yeah, so I've, I've been quite happy with the way things have gone and um, up to now I thoroughly recommend it but, but, there's one but, this is the hardest thing I've ever done in my life and I was just saying to Sue, she's, you know, just cooked the uh, tea for the kids and uh, it's bloody hard just to drink things, it's unnatural if you know what I mean. Any road up, that's it for me vlog, me little update. And uh, I'll keep you informed and uh, look forward to your comments. So, bye for now and ride safe.